Welcome to BalsaCircle.com, your one-stop shop for all of your event decor. Today we're going to show you how to put together these foam flowers. They're absolutely gorgeous. They come in several sizes and colors. As you can see, there's a gorgeous variation of colors here, pastels, really vibrant colors. Here's the front and back when it's like the finished product and also the backing so you can see how it looks. So let's get ahead and start with our 8-inch white artificial flower. And this is the color of ivory this is one of our most popular flowers they're so beautiful and they accent any of our vibrant or pastel colors as you can see each of them has a wire in the back and you just go ahead and mold it how you like on the back we've got some velcro on there with adhesive as well to put on a curtain a backdrop or whatever you'd like here is our 16 inch wide artificial flower and this is the color of lavender it's got the same setup on the back with that pin there and this has also got kind of a, a larger wiring in the back this one's a little bit more hefty but it's got that smooth silkiness as well for this one what I love about these is they're so gorgeous in real life I cannot tell you when you compare these to the paper flowers the fact that you can reuse them and they look silky smooth every single time I think that this takes half the time to put together as well like it's a win-win with these you can see in the middle it, those don't have the wire that kind of budding area and and on the edges if you want the flower to kind of be open and curving up you can manipulate this flower however you'd like especially if you have a design and you're kind of putting different sizes together you can form the leaves or those petals however you'd like so there it is it's very large I will say this if you do a design with these you definitely don't need a lot um, if it's a smaller area so once again we've got that same kind of velcro adhesive um, duo there as I had mentioned these are great for a backdrop especially if you have a smaller budget you can pair it with this ivory color that's why those are so popular because they're great pairs and let's go ahead and just show you how you would put it on a backdrop so one of the tricks here is to just fasten that pin um, around the actual wire or the ribbing in the back and that way you can put it on the backdrop and then you won't have to worry about it falling during the event this adhesive backing is really great for you to just stick it on to the actual backdrop it's not too too sticky so it's definitely easy to take off when the night is over or when the event is over and here once again we've got that same kind of strategy for this 16 inch wide lavender one those two really bunch up nicely together as you can see we did it a little bit too close in the beginning but it's such an easy move and here you go we just moved it over the pin over just a touch and then went ahead and stuck it onto that curtain this is an example of how it looks with our other colors oh my gosh the pastels and the vibrance that this gives off just I can see how popular these are and they just go they go miles so hopefully you guys enjoyed this found it helpful make sure you like the video share it with your friends and subscribe for all of your creative decor and party ideas until next time stay creative